privilege to be here for Stan Lee. Let me tell you. They brought it over to me, and it was a, you know, the strip. And I think that's what they're referring to when they say that they may have had a few missteps in this rebranding with the SYFY. <laughs> And he was a he was a he was a chef. He he loved to cook. Um, that was everyone's thing. That was. Uh, I like to ask you, uh, how did it feel to read the last script for all you three? Ready? Oh, I'm sorry. Reading the last script. Reading the last script. Okay. Reading the last script. What was that like? Brutal. The last script was brutal. Um, it was hard to come to the end, like uh, Jamie was just saying. Uh, the very last scene I shot uh, was with Mary at 3.30 in the morning in the Raptor when she dies. So that was the very last shot that her and I shot together. And uh, upon completing that shot, she walked out of the, uh, the Raptor and collapsed in heaving sobs. And to this day, it's become uh, very well known that the emotional journey that our characters took were pretty honest and, and given the very final shots were, were amazingly real. Uh, when I'm saying goodbye to him, my son, uh, when I'm, you know, uh, when I see the close-ups of uh, Starbuck and Lee standing there watching the raptor go away, when I see the hand of, of uh, the president against the window and she can't even move anymore. And then, uh, of course, the, it's a very emotional journey. And it was written. It was all there. It was all there. So all we had to do is just try to rise the level of expectation because the, the commitment on part, behalf of the writing team was uh, monumental. So I will say that uh, it was a very difficult script to read because it was the end. And right. so we all kind of had stood there and shaking and reading the last page was reading the last page. And we knew it. And uh, we knew at that precise moment that this era was over yeah. and we knew it would never be duplicated and would never come again. They're going to make a movie, hopefully. One of uh, us. Yeah, Glenn Larson. <laughs> Glenn Larson's going to make the film and we wish him nothing but success. We won't be in it. Nope. None of us will. I don't think it, they, they want to go there. They, they want to go somewhere else. So, but I know, and we said it to each other when we were on stage uh, together for the final time, um, that this was truly to be uh, the most difficult show to complete and the most difficult show to try to, you know, <laughs> Put, you know, to do better the next. Yeah. How are you going to compete against this show? I mean, what, what Hawaii Five O or what, you know, what, you know, I, I, God I, bless Grace, 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 <laughs> Grace, Grace love I love Grace. You know, and I'm sitting here going, oh, Grace. You know, she she went from Battlestar to Hawaii Five O. Uh, I went on to do other stuff, but it's been stuff. It's you know, I, we had a we had a get together just recently where we helped Lavar Burton raise money for the rainbow um reading rainbow reading rainbow yeah, yeah. In, which, in which we raised about six million dollars and we were all there and trisha was there and james callis was there and katie was there and we were all there and we were sitting there and the first time that i had heard katie say you know i really miss the show yeah and because she was like the first one wanting to get off the show you know, yeah. she was like, toward the end, she was going, yay, we finished! Yeah, yeah. and we are going, right. oh, man, you have no idea. She, had, she was like, what, 24, 25? And she, yeah, no, she was a young, she was a young yeah. person. And this was her first major piece of work. So they, all of these guys were getting ready to launch their careers, and they had launched them. And they were on their way. I, me, Hogan, and Mary turned to each other and said, thank God we got this at this age and not when we were in our 20s because to have to live with the understanding of what we created 
and then trying to either match it or at least have the same kind of feeling, very difficult. Yeah. May you guys find it. I mean, I pray that you can do it more than once. I couldn't do it more than once. I've been doing this for 44 years. I gotta tell you, I did it once. And I don't think I'm gonna do it again. You know, this kind of a show just doesn't come around. So anyway, that's what I felt reading that script. Uh, real quick, just a real quick message for you, James. Um, surreal, uh... There's two Jameses here. Which one? Oh, all, all of them. Okay. Me? Um, we have a version. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I like to ask you in Spanish. Go ahead. Algún mensaje para los fans de, de Battlestar Galactica. Un mensaje especial para ellos. Sí, quiero decirles a todos ustedes que me están entendiendo ahorita, por favor, levanten la mano con orgullo. Okay. For those of you that are Spanish impaired, don't worry. God, you live in an English-only country. Don't worry. Okay? Para todos ustedes que me están entendiendo, quiero decirles completamente que es un orgullo estar aquí sentado como uno de los um, actores que pudo tener la experiencia de trabajar en Battlestar Galactica. Eh, fue un uh, honor y fue la única, el único tiempo que he tenido en toda mi carrera diciéndoles que, que este, este uso de televisión fue el mejor uso que he tenido en toda mi vida. So I say to all of you that weren't understanding me, I just tell them hi, I just said hi. <laughs> Battle Scouts Galactica kept me awake for uh, for four days straight. I couldn't go to work or sleep because I just had to watch the whole thing from Netflix. And, um, Did you see it in four days? You might be a well-read well, uh, No, we saw the whole thing in, in a matter of like two or three weeks. Yeah, but you know, that takes some days to watch. Yeah. And it, it, was, it was a great ride. I mean, I enjoyed it. And I'd like to thank you for that. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys, that's time. So one last round of applause for our guests. We'll be here for another two hours. Go ahead. What do you want to say? Ask the question. What was it like to find out you were a Cylon? Yeah. What was it like to find out you were a Cylon? I wear it proudly. They're my family. There's my breath and right over there with this scoping eye. Look at that thing. Those are my people. Uh, it was completely and utterly confusing and, and, and made no sense whatsoever and uh, it completely derailed me and that's all I did for the last five or six episodes was just be utterly confused. And he was not the only one. I have to tell you this right now. Hogan refused to accept it. But I'm not kidding you. He was so angry that he brought that anger onto the character in the scene when they all get together for the first time inside the hangar bay. When they all, f finally the four of them get together and they they all look at each other saying, holy shit, we're all Cylons. And and, and Michael was so pissed off. And, and, and to this day, I must tell you, to this day, he created one of the most outstanding situations I've ever been a part of. When he tells me that he's a Cylon and he stands in front of <laughs> he's my oldest friend of 40 years, and he's telling me that he's a silent. I almost started laughing in the seat, but then he got serious, and we kicked the shit out of each other <laughs> and broke the ship again. You know, it was <laughs> and then he gets to hit him. I was, I was, I was so grateful that you plowed him, man, because I never got to hit him. I actually don't remember that at all. You don't remember hitting him? No, no. I, I haven't watched the show at all. I'm waiting till my kids are old enough and I'm going to watch it in four days straight and beat the record. <laughs> well, you hit him. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank Bless you your hearts. Thank you all. If you have any more questions, don't hesitate to come over. You guys can just come over. You don't have to buy anything. Just come on over and say hello. We're all over there sitting down, so we'll see you there if you have more questions.